But I'd like to talk about Hevertry and Whipton Active Streets project. John, you don't you don't you don't live in Whipton at the moment, but you know. No, I know I know of Whipton because I used to live there. So you know you know the area I'm I'm talking about. Yeah, I know the area fairly well, so, or very well. So, what's what's going on? I think it's in, in August they're going to experiment by closing a lot of streets and dividing. Well, let's say Poslow Road and a sort of road parallel to that, going along to Sainsbury's. And then Paisley Road and Hevertry Road is like the borders of it. And then inside of that, it's, it's going to be divided up into areas that you can get to if you live there. There's a, there will be a way of, to, of getting there, but there won't be any through traffic uh, other than going around the edges of it. And it's experimental, but so far all these experiments have carried on, like Queen Street. They decided to carry on with it, didn't they? Um, we can go back to that one at some point. Mm. Um, but what what's happened? The the, um, the news agents, Robinson's News, which is opposite the Hebertry Health Centre, which I know you go to quite quite often. <laughs> yeah. Well, not quite often. Well, not for frivolous reasons, obviously. Uh, it's where my it's where uh, it's just the doctors, isn't it? So yeah, that's yeah. where I go. Um, they're they're actually very concerned about it because they well, the doctors or no no the, the news, news agents well the doctors might be concerned as well I don't know I'm gonna I'm gonna try and find out about this um, if it, I'm really doing saying this now so that people could could might give us more information because the the, the, the the there are clear advantages the, the bicycling might be might be easier if Ben Bradshaw wants to come on and talk on behalf of the bicyclists. That would be that would be fine, but the news agent trying to deliver newspapers see, thinks it's going to be very difficult because. Um, oh, 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 hang on, hang on. Get, right. Just be ready with that, John. Yeah. Um, a lot of the newspapers get get delivered on a bicycle uh, early in the morning. That's fine, but the ones that for different reasons aren't delivered are then delivered by van or car or something. And that's not the only service that needs vehicle access throughout that area. If that area is going to continue as a as a sort of retail system, mm. so I'm going, to, I'm going to try and find out some other ones. There's, I think it's now Morrison's sort of going sweet by lane. Is it sort? Of, I can't. I can't. I'm not sure. There's other there's other shops. Right. Going over towards Sainsbury's. I can't remember exactly. And there's a there's a printers as well, which right. which has got parking space at the at the moment. So I don't I I don't know if they'd survive or or if if the planning approach wants shops to survive in a residential area. But John con contrary was where you're living, which is sort of out of pin home. Yeah. Um, there may be a Tesco built. That's what they keep on saying. But they haven't they haven't started it yet. But they've had planning permission for quite quite a considerable for, for quite a considerable amount of time. I hear. So you're sort of you're not you're this side of the motorway, aren't you? you, you there's a lot yeah. of housing the other side of the motorway. Yeah, well, on this side of the motorway. But only only just let's say just to give listeners an idea of where you are without being mm. too specific. Mm. Um, so it'd be interesting to know what the what the what the planners think they're doing. Mm. They're building housing estates that maybe don't have any shops or facilities, and so in the spaces where those shops exist at the moment, do they do they want them to continue? Mm. Maybe there's planning theory why that shouldn't happen. Yeah. So if the if the if Devon County Council want to tell us something. Send send us an MP3 if you or, or you're very welcome between ten and twelve on, on a, a Wednesday on a Wednesday here on Follett FM. <laughs>